I'm Mark, I'm 22 at the moment, and I'm studying a mechatronic engineering degree with a double degree in economics at the University of Adelaide, and I've been with Demotech for about 18 months now. I'm Simon, I'm 22 years old, and I'm currently in my final year of studying a mechatronic engineering degree at the University of Adelaide, and I've currently done two periods of work experience at Demotech over the summer of 2007-08 and also 08 I was programming robots here before I even did robotics at uni, so when I went to uni and started doing robotics, it just came straight off the top of my head. And then a lot of the programming that you do here for PLC has really helped with at uni. It helps with doing the subjects, but if you've already done the subject, it helps to reaffirm the knowledge. And it also is encouraging to know that what you learn at uni you're actually going to use when you finish uni, so it's really good to just make sure that you know what you're doing and that you know your, your degree is going somewhere. That being involved in many projects at Demotect has helped a lot in my final year project itself. The project itself was the development of a robot that bounces on a ball. So this is our working prototype. We've also got a full scale system that we're still working on which is about the height of a human. So the robot itself uses several sensors to detect whether the robot itself is upright and then uses, uses these to drive two motors which drive the ball using straight friction drive wheels. My first project was, um, we called it MLA, but basically as soon as I walked in the door um, I had my introductions and my old health and safety inductions and then they walked me straight into a meeting uh, which had just started about the project um, that we had to do. The camera would take a photo or something and then the robot would have to come along and cut out parts of the picture. And so we had a communication um, bus set up so that the robot could talk to the camera. And then once we had that, we had to get the programmer out and actually program in here what we wanted the robot to do. On the top of the robot here is the processor. So that's the equivalent of the programmable logic and controllers that I was using at Demotech. So that's what's storing the program that controls the ball bot itself and so a lot of the knowledge that we got at Demotech through programming programmable logic controllers as well as other systems helped a lot as you just get a lot of exposure to how to program and you can develop good ways of doing so efficient methods as well as developing solutions to problems. With the ball bot itself you simply have the ball standard on top and then effectively starting the program at which point the ball bot's detecting the angle of the body and then driving the motors in order to correct that so it can balance. And then it goes. So you've got, I mean there's a whole bunch of axes on the thing and you've got to make sure that when you're programming you're in the right set of axes. And so you can go from the robot, you can go from your tool, so you set up a tool and it has its own set of axes. You can bring it down like this, and then you can make your end swivel, pull your head around so you can just turn the end of the tool. Mark and Simon were, were both really, uh, really intelligent when they came across and we could see that. They definitely have the knowledge base that the university degree uh, develops for them. When they could actually see you know, the robots moving or the, the projects developing, they, could, they were really keen to follow through with it. Um, all the challenges that they came across were definitely there to, to help them learn and to develop as an engineer and hopefully um, the outcome of all of this is that they'll be better off with their career and their, their goals in life as an engineer. I think that work experience at Demotech has helped a lot because it gives you a good idea of what it's like to actually apply the knowledge that you learn at university so that when we do go out into the workforce, into the workforce we, it's not such a scary or new place. You've got a lot more of an understanding of what to expect and how to approach it. Yeah, I agree. I think that doing a work experience at Demotech is um, really good to reassert that what you're learning at uni is actually useful in the real world and it also you know, lets you apply the knowledge that you learn so that when you go to the real world um, you know what you're in for and it's not such a big shock. Yeah, I think it's really been, been really good.